Hello everybody, Jeffs and Jeffettes, I'm here with Father Jeff, he says hi, hi, <clears throat> nice talking now, hi everybody, it's a total of three people watching, and I've been told that they're going to ask me some horrendous questions, so whenever you're ready, Say, say something. Oh God, there's nine already. <laughs> this, this could be eventful. I'm just gonna have a brew. There's actually a coffee, but don't tell any fellow Yorkshire people. And Trevor Dowes is viewing your video. We've just yeah. been re reading your joke, Trevor. Jeff and Father Jeff. If you've got any uh, um, questions for, for for Big Jeff, old man Jeff, then give it a whirl. Um, <laughs> this is just random. Oh, I've only got 20% battery, so I'm going to have to go to the living room and stick this on charge, otherwise this ain't going to work. So hold on, so I've got to... Carry me biscuits as well. Do I like gnomes? No. Dad says, do you like gnomes, Dad? No. Why do you not like gnomes? Because they're stupid. Oh, God. He's just, he has just put his foot in it. These lot love gnomes. Gnomes? Like, yeah, it's like their thing. Well. Like how Yorkshire people are tight, they've got gnomes. We, well, Yorkshire people aren't tight. <laughs> there you are, ladies and gentlemen. Um, a bit of a. Have you put any sugar in this? No. Never puts any sugar in it. Just go up and do your thing. Sorry, right. just go. Here he is. <laughs> Blocking us off. <laughs> Feel a bit like qualified here. Right. There you go. There you go. There we are. Right. Uh, thanks, thanks, Rob. I'll take that as a compliment. But I don't mind gnomes, even if my dad thinks and see what goes on. So, uh, Dad, you're getting a video from Trevor. And it's, um, interesting. So, uh, right, where are we? Yeah. yeah. Trev sent you a video, apparently. Oh. But he said to warn you before you watch it. Um... I use Factor 50, and I have to use Factor 50, because, as you can see, I'm a little bit ginger here, and fair head on top. Um, so, yeah, I have to wear pretty big Factor sun cream, a bit like um, Ginger Jeff's in touring cars, Cook and Morgan. Mm. Pineapple on pizza. Yep. Mm hmm With ham. Hawaiian is the one. Are you a natural strawberry blonde? This is all blonde. What's left of it? It is proper blonde. Saw some up here. Yep. I cannot play the guitar. No way. Except from one song, very badly. Will I ever be in a touring car? What quarantine? Sicily Motorsport, touring cars. Hopefully. We'll see. That's the plan. Uh, quilted or normal? Oh, hang on. I think we're on about bog roll here. Quilted. Defo. Um. Plato, I don't really know, I haven't seen much of him. Um, 
but Jeff Sutton's been doing alright in that Subaru, hasn't he? He's been going well, so fair play to him. Been good to see. Um, McDonald's. Don't like KFC. Too many bits. My hair is not going on my head. It's disappearing. Whole biscuit, good work. <laughs> I've only got one biscuit left, so. That's it. And I thought you might like the whole biscuit. You crazy lot. Right. There's Dav. Oh dear. Right, any more? What's what's your favourite meat dish? I want something like steak. Bob. Um meat dish. Lasagna. Is definitely lasagna, if that counts. My road car is a diesel 1.5 Clio. That's horrendous, and I want a new one. Uh, dream car, Lamborghini. Strawberry or chocolate milkshake? I'd say strawberry. Definitely, yeah, strawberry. We used to have a known, but I don't know where it's gone. I reckon one of you lot stole it at Croft last year. <laughs> Uh, I've no idea. Um, we we did used to have a, no, a norm. Um, Morganator or norm? Depends what mood they're both in, I think. Um, you can never really beat norm, so... He's just too good. You need to get him on one of these these chats as well. Right, do, but do I prefer Norm or Morganator? It's a tough one. I don't know. They're both good crack. Right, I don't know the answer to that one. Would you rather get attacked by 15 duck-sized horses or one horse-sized duck? Fifteen duck-sized horses, I think. The sound of a horse-sized duck is pretty horrendous. How do you have your Weetabix? Um, I don't. I've shredded wheat, Dad. No, that's too. Um, yeah, Weetabix have to be with sugar and milk. Is that not how everybody has them? I have brand new merchandise range that's for sale at one of the best trade stands in the land from Dav Goosey, who may or may not own that stand, and that may or may not be true. Oh, God. Um, mm. Thanks for the suggestion, Trev. Marmite, love. Yeah, don't always have it, though, but it's all right. It's good. It's good as Marmite. Were you in hot fuzz and did you get real handcuffs? Um, yeah, we're not in it with you, Mr. Jeff Waller. Um, no, that wasn't me. I wish it was, because then I'd be rich and... Well, I'd be rich and <laughs> I could go racing cars. But, uh, yeah, I wasn't in hot fuzz as much as I wish I did, was. And it's quite worrying that I look like a 40-year-old man, or however old he is. If you could be half man and half sausage, which half would be which? Bloody hell, that's a question, that. I like that. That's really difficult. 
Hi. Guess you mean top and bottom half by that, not not side and sides, because that'd be easy then, wouldn't it? Um. I don't know. I don't really want to be half sausage and half bad. <laughs> uh, I would no. Let's let's go with. Where does the half end? I don't want to lose. You know me bits. So I would hang on. Um. This sausage thing's really got me struggling. Uh, right, I'm gonna go bottom half sausage, but as long as it's below me, me, me balls. Uh, racing ambition at the moment, touring cars, British. After that, I don't know. I would have said world touring cars, but I don't really know that it's any anything more. Do you know what I mean? I think British touring cars is where it's at at the moment, so. Um, I'd love to race in V8 supercars. Australia looks mint, but it's hot, so I'd quite like to do that. The Bush, bromance or nomance, and I guess you mean Mike Bushell, not Gary Gazabush in our team. Uh, and I think both would probably be bromance, to be honest. Although at times with Mr Bushell, there's possibly been nomance. Why aren't you with the best Yorkshire team in the paddock? Because I'm with the best Lancastrian team in the paddock. Uh, very simple. If you could get one sponsor on your car, who would you have? Whoever offers the best freebies. Probably a car company. I don't know, like Ferrari or Lamborghini or something like that. What's it like working with Big Norm? Stressful. Funny. Halfway is the waste. It's bloody hard, that, Stuart. That's a really hard question. I've never thought about being half sausage. I've decided bottom half. Bottom half will be sausage, top half will be not would be man that's it that's the answer why because i can then always think but I can't. yeah i can always think and stuff then and i can always do what i want to do and then you know it's the legs i mean sausage it's a lot of fun with the sausage there's your legs how do you deal with norman morgan morgan um, with great difficulty usually, but they're they're all right. They know what they're on about. They're uh, um, I'm halfway through reading the next cover. It always looks already looks funny. How are you doing, Norman and Morgan? Um, you've got to give them as much banter as what they give you, uh, which is difficult because they're pretty bloody funny. Um, oh, hey, look at this! You can have a look at live viewers. Um, I deal with them, I think with banter, but they don't really laugh. And, yeah, just, all right, really, they're good, they're good crap. My wife lost her wedding ring in a swimming pool. When she got back to the car and her bag was missing, someone had eaten her lunch. But what I really want to know is, you could be a bird, <laughs> where would you, shit. <laughs> I don't understand that, Gary, but I guess in a toilet. I've no idea what that means. What do you like on pancakes? Mm, treacle, right, golden syrup, that's the one. Hi, Marie, hello. Okay, so that's, um, oh God, right, go on, Stuart. Favourite colour, red. Would you rather lick Kiki's a bit or belly button? Belly button because I've seen his bloody hard bit. <laughs> nah. 
have you seen Plato? He's driving race car, I think. Favourite racetrack away from Croft? Brands GP, I think. Or um, Knock Hill. Uh, real wood doors or fake wood? Real wood. Oh, sorry, Stuart. You need to get in the 21st century, mate. And then you can then you can view your little Yorkshire friend. Cheers. Um. Yeah. How do I have Flash Player? You like on a 1966 laptop or something? Um. Continue to fat to 50 on your sausage leg. Probably gonna have to, really. Because if I don't, I burn and then peel, and then, then it's even worse. Dream car, I've already said, as Lamborghini. Hello, Amy. Hello, Stuart. Hello, Lynn. Um, what is Vidal Sasson? Is that like. I don't know. Is that some old people use? I don't know. Head and shoulders, I guess. How tall? Oh, no, I can't stand up with this in my hand. That tall. Does that make it any easier? <laughs> there we go. Um, wash and guy. Gary Hob. Wash. I don't understand what that means. <laughs> right, who's who's having who's browsing this then? Trevor Dows, Dave Santos, who's organised this? Top job, Dave. Amy Smith, hello Amy. Scott Waller. It's moved. Zoe Haywood. Oh why is it Stuart Lines? Right, Stuart, what shampoo? Well, I've never heard of Vidal Sasson, so that means it's... Uh, God knows. Does it really look like I take much note of hair stuff? Best County, Yorkshire, sorted. That's <laughs> Stuart Noah Media Day is. It's, um, it's the big stain on the ceiling. That is a wooden beam thing. Yeah. Wooden beam. <laughs> Who would win in a fight? Big Norm, 100%. He's a little, little terrier, isn't he? He'd be nothing left of, of poor lines, he? Oh, God. Do I have to... <laughs> Jeff Hill, <laughs> oh, Jakey boy, he made a bit of a mess of it at the weekend, didn't he? With with that boy, he's, he's a good lad. He's, um, I'm sure it was just the reaction that we all we all have in them situations. And I can't say that I haven't been very wound up after a race. So you know, it, you know, he's he's apologised. That's the main thing. Jeff Waller, Jeff Santos. <sighs> I want to get killed whichever way I say that, aren't I? Um, I'm, right, I'm going to go with Jeff Santos because uh, he's funnier. Hello, Alistair, and and sorry, Walla. That's a problem. Donkey or Zebra? Donkey. There isn't a bloody st stain, you... It must be a light. Boxers. No chance Fat Norm would get a right paste in. Mm. I'd, um, I don't know. Johnny Vegas. That is not Norm. Favourite drink on a night out? Mm. Depends what sort of mood I'm in. If you're on a beer, it's got to be a lager. <clears throat> Scott Waller has, has left the conversation. Uh, he meant fat and not funnier. I knew this would cause a stir. Sorry. Um, 
You're welcome, Helen. Anytime. Have you snogged Jade Edwards? Nah. Nope. I nearly walked in on her getting changed, though. I would have been the closest this far, this, this, this year, so. Sorry, Jade. Six or nine? Or both? Uh, snog Jade? No, I haven't. Uh, what happened last time you got drunk? Uh, I gave somebody a piggyback. That's about as much fun as it got. Um, six or nine. I don't really understand uh, where we're going with that one. Like most of these questions. Why does Jeff O'Neill never get any of his race win predictions right? Don't know. He knows what he's on about. So... Just obviously a bit wrong. Can I come down the garage and scrape some tyres? Yeah. Um, I'm sure Kieran would love a hand with scraping tyres. Edwards or Polly, we've got to keep it in Team Sicily, haven't we, Edwards? Come on. Have to go, Jeff and Jeff, at see you at Alton. Thanks for the hardest question um, of the night, Stuart. Top man. Um, and... Um, what was I going to say? Oh, I've forgotten. What? Oh, yeah, there, here's a question. What do you call someone who's already Jeff? How does that work in, in Jeff Army? If they're already called Jeff, then what do you call them? Jeff Jeff. Uh, an apprentice mechanic. I don't, Nicole. Um, if I do, I will let you know. Uh, but it's obviously pretty hard to get into the motorsport world. There's always people asking, so uh, um, so yeah, it's pretty hard. But just keep keep getting in touch with people, and I'm sure someone will, will get you along at some point. <laughs> Thomas Barrow, my favourite team member is Liam. Sorry, sorry, mate. Then it's you, obviously. But I've got to say it's Norman, because if not, then I'll be kicked out of the team. Uh, i got to go and try to and be funny, and I'm going to shove your phone fingers next time when I see you right up here. <laughs> Cheers, mate. That's what they've been designed for, isn't it? So uh, we'll, we'll see you at Alton and Scott. Sorry that you're leaving, and sorry for uh, ruining your life. Um, I had pasta, sausage and chorizo for lunch, which is pretty nice. You never wave at me, Jade does. I'd, I looked at you on the in-lap, well, it was my in-lap because it was the only lap I did at Thruxton, Gary. I did actually see you and because you didn't wave, I didn't stop at your post. So, you know, genuine Jeff. Thanks, Phil. Thanks for answering that one. Uh, and... I do always wave. Okay, so you call him Jeff. Genuine Jeff. Gen okay, so I think it's genuine Jeff. Do you think Scott Wally is a bit of a dick? Uh, no, he's alright. He's alright. Can't say that. I've just ruined his life already. Barmy Army or Jeff Army? Um, it's an army. Whichever one I choose. Oh, God. Staying, staying within the lines, I think Jeff Army has the banter. Um, <laughs> the lines are you, these rubbish internet. Um, Simon Palmer, I could not possibly answer that, but I know he likes a phone finger. Put a tenner in, Barry Lee's son Freddie, I know him, yeah, will 
get into the BTCC. So it's 500 to 1 out of 10. Is that 50 grand? No, it's not. Five grand. No, it's not worth buying a seat for him then. Hi, Mark. Uh, do you like Michael Bolton? Is he a singer? I think he's... I don't really have... If he doesn't race cars, I don't really know who he is. When are you joining Team Hard? Uh, no. Uh, we're, we're Sicily Motorsport through and through. So, yeah. Where do you aim to be BTCC? For sure, Dave, is is um, is is where I want to be. Uh, yeah, touring cars. It's fun. You race. You overtake people and have to defend. So that's the um, that's that's what I like. How did you do in maths? I was all right actually. Got two A's. I did extra maths at. GCSE, and then I started at A level and was rubbish and gave up. I don't like it. Um, cheesiest album, Crazy Frog. That is a, that is a tune. Uh, yeah, got Crazy Frog album. Uh, buy me a beer at Croft. It's nowhere to buy a beer, but I might have a plan with that. Is this mum? Oh. <laughs> yes, I am regretted it. Hang on, my mum's just come in. Mum! I'm in the front room. Okay, I'm just doing a Q&A live on Facebook. A Q&A thing. So that means she doesn't want to come and say hi. Um, yeah, so Mark, if we can sort out a way to, to go about getting beers there, uh, or this other idea that I might have that's in the pipeline, then we will see what's going on. Do you regret this yet? No, it's been all right. What went on with Infinity? So, um, I obviously got a, a, the drive with Infinity for, for the Croft Brown Championship. We... We had the budget to do that, and um, and we were working on actively working on sponsors in the in the six week break, um, and and it and it just didn't come together, um, and I was absolutely gutted. Probably the worst point of my racing career. Um, something I never wanted, never a, a place that I don't want to be in again. Um, and a place that I won't let happen again. So um, I've learned quite a lot from from what happened there, and 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 that won't that won't happen again. Um, so I'm in I'm in a good place. They're a really good team, um, and I'm sure that if an opportunity comes in British touring cars, that that will make it work correctly this time. So that's went on. Um, but yeah, I, I still. Know all the guys there, still got on really well with them, um, and and they're and they're a good they're a good group. So um, yeah, still still chat with quite a few of them. Is that a slim fit shirt? It's a bit shrunk, shrunk now, isn't it? Yeah. So this this was like my pre uni shirt, and then smart shirt for doing presentations whilst I was at uni, and then it didn't fit me by the end of uni, and now it fits me again. So that's all right. Can you give us a quick medley of Ed Sheeran songs? Um, a secret, Obviously, sing Ed Sheeran at the top of my voice in the car on the way to to and from work. I I think he does cracking songs, uh, but I only do it in my car, and I'm not gonna do it here. However much, mm, no, you'd have to pay me a decent amount of money, and then I probably would. But uh, Alison Brewer, I love that frog. It's it's the best. Who's your fave driver in the paddock? Um, Same Morgan is a bit too obvious, really, isn't it? But he's he's good and has really impressed me this year. So um, <laughs> I don't want to. Why do you all want me to sing? Um, 
Are you better at golf than Crazy Frog and Vegas? I am rubbish at golf, but I want to learn and I want to get a bit better, and I will do at some point. Uh, ah, ling, ding, 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 ding. That's all I can do. It's a bit like Seb Battle, like it with the Crazy Frog song. Um, I'm not doing any more. Fave driver in the paddock. Uh, I'm going uh, Adam Morganator Morgan. Um, but, you know, there's other guys in there who I got on with really well. Jake Hill. Uh, I've known Jake for a long time. Um, who else do we, do we know? Do we get along with? There's some pretty funny guys. And, uh, and, and to be honest with you, get along with most people. Uh Um, I studied sports marketing at uni, uh, so I went to Leeds Beckett, came out with a first, I'd done all right. Um, yeah, so I've been to uni, got a sports marketing degree, um, and that's it's really helped in terms of getting the sponsorship to be back out on track this year. So, so yeah, that's that's kind of what, what I did there. Uh, right now, Gary, I use no hair products because I run out, and I was supposed to get some before Thruxton, and I haven't had time, and it's been very busy since Thruxton, so I've not had a chance to get any. Um, but usually I would use this hair wax called Beaver, which is really good. Weird name, but good. Hi mum, hi mum, hi mum. Uh, my brother is a faster runner than me, which is rubbish. Hi Leanne, hi Mark. Uh, how's Norman Burgess been out with your mum? He'll tell you that he has. But uh, I hope not. I really hope not. For her sake. Uh, strawberry blonde, stra strawberry, strawberry blonde racing drivers just fast. Gingers are quick. That's it. Will you sign my forehead? Yes. I work at a group of children's nurseries um, as marketing executive. So. Bit different, very, very different to, to motorsport, but gives me um, time off. Have I got a stalker? I just said stalker. Oh, hang on. Yeah, I do. Yes. Uh, someone who always takes a mick out of me for, for stalking me is Liz Gorman. She, when I was in Geneta Juniors, I was... The first time someone like took a picture of me, I wasn't like in a race car. I was a bit like, "This is a bit weird," but all right, whatever. Uh, and was in the grandstand at Brands Hatch, and then ever since then, she's always taken the mick for stalking me, and, and that's fine. Are you scared of the new Rocky and the Grid, aka Jay Kill after the weekend? No, he wouldn't hurt a fly, wouldn't Jake? He's proper nice lad. Is that your nan's chair? Might have been actually. I don't know. It's nice, it's comfy, and but more importantly, it's near the charger. Who don't you get along with? I'm not answering that one. I'm sorry. How many coats do you own? <laughs> uh, actually, quite a lot. So I've got a big coat, and then I've got lots of other coats, like soft shell jackets. Show us your pants, Jeff. Dancing style. Hmm. What have I got on? <laughs> Wax. These, these, these are awesome boxes, but then I'm not going to show you right now. Not, gonna, I'm never going to show you. You don't need to see my boxes, Gary. They're not, they're not that entertaining. Slips of Elcro. Slips. <laughs> Alan Stalker. It's not me. Cracking. Liz Gorman Stalker. Yes, you're gonna like. So, what else is going on? Who, who's watching now? I don't find that out. Uh, Coke, not Pepsi. Uh, dance off in the Kent again, end of the season. Yep, yeah, see you there, Phil. We'll, we'll be in there. We will be creating the dance circle again. Um, so, yeah. Good man. Have I ever been asked for an autograph whilst having a slash? Nope. Nope, not, not yet. Um, I don't really look forward to that day. Uh, vibrating boxers, no, they just say wax on them, which is hilarious because it's my name with an upside down M. Simpsons or Family Guy? Ooh. 
Asked me a couple of years ago, I probably said Simpsons, but now Family Guy. But I don't really watch that much telly now. It's not race cars. A bit like uh, Stuart Lyons, don't have like any internet or anything. Uh, Burger King, KFC, too many bits. Favourite food? Um, shepherd's pie, generally. Or lasagna. Or hot chocolate fudge cake. He has a thong on, that's why. Steady. <laughs> wax on or wax off. Right now they're wax on. But at other times they are wax off. Right. What else have we got coming? How long, how long have we been on here for? 35 minutes. I hope this has been good. There's me stainy roof again. Um, do you think Jeff Waller gives good cuddles? He might have done, but I don't think he'll give me any more now. <laughs> I was a bit creepy, sorry. <laughs> uh, weather is good. Been nice and sunny today. Uh, cheers, Jeff Santos. And I'm guessing you like it because uh, we've we've uh, fobbed Mr. Um, Waller off. So yeah, it's good. Mm. Mm. I'm just looking at other things on this. Uh, I do not shave my legs. Never shaved my legs. I don't think. I shaved my legs? No. I don't think I've ever shaved my legs. Favourite holiday destination? Anywhere that's got snow. I love skiing. That's the one. Tips for Alton. Who will be good? Um, I am going... Well, you're never going to discount the Hondas. They're always going to be quick. Uh, Ingram's been quick all year. I don't see that stopping. Um, Morganator. He's going to be up there. He, he's been on it all season. He'll have, he should have a bit less ballast on, I think, at, at Alton Park, so that should help him. Um, and um, I would say Ash Sutton as well, Mr Jeff Sutton. He, well, the BMW was, was fast there last year, so I'd imagine that it will be. Um, hi, Simon, and hi, Phil. So, Yeah. Uh, how many more questions have we got then? Has anybody else got anything, anything else? Mm. You could now, would you go back and have one off racing juniors? Yes. Especially with all the guys who used to be in juniors, that would be epic. Um, Favourite cheese? Cheddar or Swaledale? They used to be sponsored by their cheese as mint, but if not, then like normal cheap Tesco's cheese is like cheddar. Um, yeah, definitely juniors, but it would it would be it would have to be with all the all the old guys. That'd be great. Um, eye colour. Mm, blue. Um, favorite music. A little bit of an old boy like that. I like, um, I like sort of all the modern pop stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm into a bit of, like, status quo and queen and that sort of thing, so. Uh, superstitions. Um, e yeah, I've sort of developed a little one this year and, and a ritual. So when I'm getting in the car, I've got an order that I put my lap belts on him. So that I'll pull the crotch strap up first, then the right one, and then the left one. Don't know why. And if I put the right, the left, yeah, the right one first. If I put the left one in first, then I'll undo it and do it again. Weird, I don't know, but you know, it's one of them things. And yeah, and like the the when I come back to the grid, I have a, a proper good. <laughs> I have a good tug on my helmet. <laughs> uh, on the on the race lid. Uh, check that's all tight. And the the um, what's it called? Old straps. On the on the thing, it's just a bit of a thing that I do on the way to the grid and stuff. Um, other than Ed Sheeran, Ed Sheeran's the one. Make a funny noise. Uh, yeah, <laughs> you'll understand what that is. Um, what team would you run with though? I'd run it myself. If I went back to Janet Juniors like we used to. Good old days. Uh, and I guess you're alluding to me to say HHC, Jonathan. Uh, 
as their social media man. Seeing the stone roses. I haven't, Simon, but it sounds good. Um, I have heard of them. Red wheels or wagon wheels or orange wheels? Uh, red wheels, and I do like wagon wheels. They're good. Do you own a Clio Sport? Uh, no. I own a Clio, not Sport, 1.5 diesel rubbish. Pick any car, past or present, to do a lap of the Nürburgring. Either Ginetta G50 or Porsche Cup car. If you could remove one driver from the grid, who? <laughs> no comment. <laughs> My sister says a uh, Cleo oversteers on the way to the hairdressers. Any advice? Power. Floor it, mate. That's all you need. Keep her pinned and she'll be good. Saying that though, Stu, if you got you out of the passenger seat, then uh, then the weight balance might help it, might, you know, make it un oversteer a little bit less. Brands India or GP? GP all the way. That's the one. Uh, it's good, yeah. Um, what spares do you need? Um, you have to take Lindsay seriously, but yeah, if you know seriously, if he if he does if he does take a bit of weight out of it, then it might might help. You know, and if he's in the passenger seat, that's the other thing. So if you're in the passenger seat, then get somebody else in. Actually, whilst we're on the subject of Lindsay, can you remember when you wanted to come start a fight with me at Croft in that Infinity when he thought I'd fired you off, but it wasn't me; it was my teammate. I wasn't my he didn't fire you off, but he thought he did or something like that. That was quite funny. Um, oh, ye plonker, John. Um, yeah. Right, how we doing? Right, a couple of minutes left. If there's anything else, let's uh, let's give it a whirl. <laughs> Too fast, in eh? Do you have a nickname? Depends if you talk to Norman Burgess or not. He's got loads of nicknames for me. Uh, I don't think so. Have I got my wife? Uh, Right. Oh, Steny Roof again. Does my car have a name? Yes, it does. Uh, it is called Layla. Um, it's named after um, a little girl who's a family friend. Um, and yeah, she just wanted to. Um, she wanted. Well, she. Um, it was just a nice thing to do, basically. So um, I'm not going to it. Um, yeah, yeah. They're up there. That's where I have all the answers. Good luck for the future. Thanks, Martin. Um, right. So unless there's anything else, I think we'll uh, we'll we'll pop off at that. It's been a good little Q and A, bit different to uh, the usual kind of thing. So um, yeah. Cheers for all the questions and stuff. Um, and a bit of banter. Oh, God. Norman Burgess has joined. I'm going to have to keep this going for a couple of minutes. Where are you, Norm? Um, lager or ale? Lager. Watch, uh, watch Norman pop off now. Is he still watching? Hiya, Norm. By the way, Norm, I said that you were my favourite Sicily team member. You or Morganator, obviously you. You know. Oh. Here comes Mama Jeff. Hi. Hello. This is, yeah, this is live. Oh, you don't have to... Oh, Mum's being 
Mum, Gary's watching. <laughs> Come back, he's saying hello. Norman's watching. <laughs> oh, well, he was watching anyway, unless he's left. I just need Pilates to de-stress and then I've cut the grass. Why do you have to de-stress? Sometimes it's a little tricky in a motor home. Racing environment. <laughs> I keep calm, breathe. <laughs> Don't tell Norman. <laughs> Your mum... <laughs> Shut up, Lidesy. <laughs> Dinner's ready. Bloody wish. It's not. <laughs> Mum, I think Mum's got to have a drink on a race weekend, don't she? Aren't they? It, it's got to happen. And Brand's end of the season was good fun. Yes, Lionsy, she is far too good for you. Far too good. <laughs> right. Okay. I think it's sign off time. No. Oh. I can invite. Oh dear. You can do all sorts with these chats. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go, guys. I think that's um, that's um, that's that's enough for tonight. So we'll, hi John, um, we'll we'll sign off or whatever you call it, and um, and catch you all at Alton. Hopefully, it's a bit better for me rather than an eighth in DNF, which was a bit rubbish. So um, yeah, cheers everybody, and we we shall catch you at. Um, we shall catch you at Alton Park. Thanks again, guys. Bye.